Safalo Worldwide Business Conduct Manual. Chapter 5. Act in Respect Towards Others. In this chapter, we will learn what needs to act to respect towards others. Firstly, the environment. We protect the environment for future generations to come. The company is committed to meeting or exceeding all requirements of environmental laws and applicable regulations, including rules governing the use, control, transportation, storage and disposal of regulated materials that may reach the environment as a part of wastewater, air emissions, solid or hazardous waste. All employees are part of this commitment and are expected to demonstrate their stewardship of the environment by operating with respect for the environment, working to minimize environmental hazards, conserve and preserve natural resources, managing energy usage, cooperating fully with governmental authorities that carry out inspections and checks on protection of the environment, bringing to the attention of the Ethics Point hotline or website any environmental issues that raise concern. What does this mean for me? If you work in the supply chain, you must follow company guidelines in terms of disposing of extra materials. When you leave work, turn your office lights and computer off. Don't litter both in and outside Safalo offices. If you're interested in learning more about environmental laws and legislations that may affect you, contact your relative health and safety team. Secondly, our corporate responsibility towards business partners. Supply chain management. We hold our suppliers to the same standards of integrity to which we hold ourselves, and we perform periodic audits to verify that the practices of our business partners are in line with these standards. Corporate responsibility. As part of our purpose, we imbued in our pursuit of profit the corporate responsibility for people, product and profession, and planet. We have chosen six strategic areas of specific commitment. Employee relations. Product integrity. Professional mastery. Children. Empowerment of the world's most vulnerable. Reduction of waste. Community involvement. We strive to develop long-term local partnerships with selected associations through which we make a difference and which gives Safalo institutional visibility and local standing in the community, always through our reference brand, Polaroid. Focus on sustainability report. Our social and environmental policies are part of our way of doing business and specifically our relationship building with our employees, consumers, customers and suppliers and the communities in which we do business. They are integrated in all our management programs, including risk and investor relations management. A specific sustainability report will be published from 2017, showing the progress that the company is making in this area other people and the government. The company does not tolerate any form of bribery or corruption. Safalo has a zero tolerance policy for all forms of bribery and corruption. This includes payments or the exchange of anything of value to influence business decisions, extortion and kickbacks. This means that employees or anyone acting on behalf of the company must follow the following guidelines. Never give or agree to give or offer or receive anything of value to persuade someone to act in your favor. Never seek or accept anything of value to give business to a new or existing supplier. Be mindful of the bribery risks posed by engaging with government officials and ensure our engagements are always open, honest and transparent. You can use legitimate fast-track processes in order to expedite routine decisions, but never make facilitation payments to government officials in order to secure an action or a service, for example, permit or license. Should you become aware of any potential or actual corrupt arrangements or agreements, speak up and report them to the Ethics Point hotline or website. Example, what counts as anything of value? Corruption may involve the exchange of anything of value. This could include goods, services or merchandise, such as gift cards, event tickets, retail certificates, entertainment, travel perks, use of vacation homes, free airfare or accommodations, special favours or privileges, donations to designated charities, discounts, free personal services, loans or a promise of future employment. 
a government health inspector has arrived at a company manufacturing plant. May I present the inspector with a pair of sunglasses as a sign of goodwill? No, you should never give gifts to government officials. Giving the product to the inspector under these circumstances may be perceived as a bribe intended to influence the inspector's review of the facility. Laws and regulations. The company always complies, without exception, with all local laws and regulations. The standards in this manual represent the globally consistent minimum standards and will be further elevated in a given country when not legally sufficient, but may never be lowered irrespective of the legal minimum. Compliance with competition law. Safalo complies with all competition laws that regulate free competition and expects its employees to follow the Safalo Group antitrust policy. Anti-money laundering. The company complies with all laws that prohibit money laundering or financing for illegal or illegitimate purposes. If you suspect money laundering activities, speak up and report it to the Ethics Point hotline or website. For more information, contact the Treasury Department. International trade restrictions. The company complies with all applicable trade regulations and follows all government-imposed trade restrictions. Employees have a responsibility to understand and abide by the legal requirements applicable to the business. For any further guidance and advice, contact the legal and tax departments. Example 1. Can I ask my supplier a question about a competitor's future prices? No, we should not have advance warning of a competitor's future prices. Example 2. I have noticed a number of larger-than-usual transactions passing through a customer. Should I report this? Any activity you suspect could be linked to money laundering needs to be reported straight away. There are serious consequences for failing to report money laundering concerns. Thank you for watching the Worldwide Business Conduct Manual.